Welcome to Sling Aircraft and our Sling Aircraft production hangar for the Howings. We'll be prepping the three Howings to fly over to Oshkosh in the beginning of July. Um, it's quite exciting, lots going on, so let's go have a look. JP's aeroplane, which is going to be a tail dragger. It's going to have, be an aeroplane with a lot of ramp presence. It's going to be a work of art on our side, I think. Um, the electrics guys are finishing up the panel. We're going to prime the fuel system, um, do the oil, and it should be ready to start by the end of the day, which is very exciting. A great morale booster. Let's have a look at the aeroplane in close up. So here we are with JP's aeroplane with Jonathan from Aeronautical Aviation. He's doing the panel install and hooking up the loom to the fuselage. And if you want to have a look, the panel has just been turned on. It's looking beautiful in all its glory. Uh, it's a complete garment install. So let's head over now towards our aircraft and Linda's aeroplane. These are both going to be tricycle undercarriages. This aeroplane is going to be flying to Oshkosh with the other two and it's going to head up north, go to the UK. It's going to spend a few weeks there and we're going to fly down through Africa. It's going to be a sling adventure, one that we have become quite accustomed to here at the company. Obviously using the Rotax 915 and all three aircraft is a brilliant power plant. We've had no issues with them um, in the last few years and it is the future of general aviation. So it's lovely to be working with a company like Rotax on these engines. Obviously their support from their side has been brilliant. So really enjoy working with Rotax on these. Our electrics department is doing the install for the avionics and we are engraving the panels, powder coating, engraving the panels. They are coming a long way. Very, very beautiful panel. So now onto Linda's aircraft. The aeroplane that I've wanted most out of the factory personally because of the paint scheme. It is the most complicated paint scheme we've done to date. She's chosen quite a bespoke paint scheme designed by scheme designers in the US and um, it's been a challenge from our side but our spray shop department has done in my opinion an absolutely beautiful job. If you want to come and have a look at the panel on the inside of the aircraft this was done by Midwest Panel Builders Again, very, very beautiful implementation of the Garmin G3X system. So this panel was built by Midwest Panel Builders using the G3X system. It is one of the more advanced panels and instrumentation systems that have been installed on a sling. It features uh, oxygen delivery systems through the panel on either side for the pilots and co-pilots, which is run by an oxygen bottle in the back of the aircraft. Along with that comes all the bells and whistles that you'd associate with the Midwest Panel Builders install. It's really beautiful work that they've done here. Linda's control stick, she's using the Tostin grip. She's put a whole load of switches and controls on the stick so she doesn't have to reach for the panel when using flaps, etc. Linda is elected, we're calling this color Linda Orange. She's painting her seats, uh, control sticks, and a lot of the interior components orange in the aircraft. It's really going to give the aircraft um, ramp presence, I think. Linda typically flies an A320 in America, and she wanted to have her lights on the top panel above her head like she would in the Airbus, making her feel more at home. So we accommodated her and put all of her lights on the top, along with her uh, heater system, which controls the temperature inside the cabin. Um, so Linda is really going to feel at home in this aircraft with all her bells and whistles. As you can see behind me, it's all hands on deck getting the aircraft ready to go to Oshkosh. So it's going to be a busy few days and nights, but I'm very excited. The team's really pulled together and we're going to pull this off. It's going to be a very exciting period for Sling Aircraft.